and we're back. Today I have something very special for you guys. We're gonna use AI to see what AI thinks Minecraft mobs look like. We're gonna be using three different AIs to see what each one of them thinks a Minecraft mob looks like. And all of them are free, so you can try and do this for yourself. And I will add them in Minecraft. Honestly, I am terrified of what we're actually gonna get. So stick to the end, starting with number one. This one's called the Gencraft. And for this one, we will see what it thinks that a Minecraft creeper looks like. So first, let's select the 3D. And then we type Minecraft and creeper mob. Now let's see what the AI thinks that a creeper is in Minecraft. I think it's gonna be a monster, but let's see. <laughs> It usually is and we're almost there just just come on just nudge a little bit more and oh boy <laughs> I guess a creeper is just a head now <laughs> oh my god does, does this guy have like a little mustache here <laughs> oh my god <laughs> okay well, which one should we use now I'm gonna flip a coin if we get heads that means it's gonna be the first one if we get tails, that means it's gonna be the second one. Heads! So it's gonna be the first one. So this is our first mob. This is the creeper mob with his little mustache. Now then, let's see what the next AI thinks that a Minecraft Enderman is. So this is the second AI. Hotpot.ai. Now considering that there's a style called 3D Minecraft 1, I have high expectations that this is gonna actually look normal. So. Let's try it out and see. We're gonna write Enderman mob. Let's see what the AI thinks that an Enderman looks like. So this is what the AI thinks that an Enderman is. I mean, it's not far from the truth. Except the fact that it has yellow eyes instead of purple eyes. Plus, I there's some people in the background. <laughs> what is, is this a cult or something? What? But I won't lie, this is actually kind of pretty cool. Now then, let's see what the next AI thinks that a Minecraft zombie looks like. And this is the final AI, which is pixart.com. So, we're gonna write down here now, Minecraft zombie mob. And let's see what this AI thinks that a Minecraft zombie mob looks like. Well, this is what we got. <laughs> and it looks unique, let's say it like that. <laughs> we're gonna be using this guy right here as what the AI thinks that a Minecraft zombie looks like. So, without any further ado, let's see what they look in Minecraft. Now then, let's see the first AI generated mob in Minecraft. Starting with the creeper, generated by Gencraft. And now, let us see how it looks like. Bang! Oh, it is way smaller than you would expect it because it is technically almost the size of a block. But size doesn't matter because you haven't seen the explosion of it. And you're not going to because it's gonna crash my PC. And now it's time for the Enderman generated by Hotpot AI. Let's place it down in three, two, one, bang. Holy mo. That's not what you expect, did ya? Yeah, that is true because he is huge. Cause if you look closely on the AI generated image, you will see that it is actually approximately 9 to 10 blocks high. And whatever you do, do not look into his eyes. Because he's not the only one who's gonna chase you. If you notice in the background, there are followers that he spawns when you look at him. And then there is the tricky part. If you look directly at him, you will die. But if you don't look at his little minions, they will move and kill you themselves. So you have to run away while also looking at the little boys but not looking at the Enderman himself. You, get away. Ooh, get away, I'm recording here. My God, you won't leave me, will you? So that is the AI generated Enderman. Now then, let's go on to the AI generated zombie. So here's the zombie egg and let's spawn him in. As you can see, he is not any bigger than the creeper himself. He is quite small, but he does pack a punch. He's a mischievous fellow and he disguises himself as if he was a normal human being in Minecraft standards, but he also camouflages himself with his green cloak, same way a creeper does. And the zombie, like I said, was generated by pixart.com. And remember, all of these AI image generators are completely free, so you can try and do this yourself. But that's all the time we have for today. If you liked this video, consider liking and subscribing. If you have any suggestions for a video, leave them in the comments below. 
that also goes for criticisms as well. And for now, bye bye See you in the next video!